Six months into the Gulf of Mexico oil disaster, birds are abundant in the rich habitats of coastal Louisiana, but oil lingers in the waters, sands, and marshes. Audubon scientists converged on the epicenter of the spill in Louisiana to survey birds in oiled and unoiled areas. They also collected samples of beach sand to analyze it for oil, other chemicals, and the tiny animals birds need to eat. Our new report, Oil and Birds, Too Close for Comfort, shows that neither the oil nor the long-term problems are gone. What we found raises many concerns. Among them, food birds need to eat could be reduced. Toxic chemicals could accumulate in birds and other animals and harm them. Harmful effects could include reduced reproductive success or reduced ability to survive stressful migrations. Extensive cleanup activities have diminished the value of habitats. Audubon scientists, along with our citizen scientists, will monitor Gulf Coast birds and habitats in the months and years to come. The BP oil spill is not the only threat to the region's birds, other wildlife, and people. We are working to counter habitat loss from the mismanagement of the Mississippi River, development and disturbance of sensitive coastal habitats across the Gulf, and the proliferation of non-native invasive species, among other threats. Audubon has been working for birds, their habitats, and the broader health of the Gulf for more than a century. Renewing this beautiful and globally important region will take all of us working together. To secure a brighter future for the Gulf, log on to audubon.org to find out how you can help.